I get what I want I need a million ones I need a couple of states To put all the haters back into their place Not bringing the base Hey, ready for the big league Never gonna miss me When I'm on the TV I'm the MVP Whenever they hear me kill it They be coming at me But I hit them with a pivot Link to the floor oh. Pass Siakam They call the foul Victor They gonna say he took his legs out from under Victor's, Victor's hurt Boy, I'm looking at his kneecap You can see it Yeah, you, you see it so Victor Oladipo goes down trying to make back. Now he he goes down, and and Siakam had absolutely just gives right there, and he goes down. You can see he's trying to protect himself, but he knew right, right leg because he knew he was in trouble. I heard I, just as he screamed out loud, so I knew. But you can see he's already reacted to it. So we've. Um, and he look at him. He pulls it right away and starts screaming yeah. and waves that. And Evans, then, so now guys are yeah. trying to help him. Stretcher here at Bankers Life Fieldhouse holds up his arms. Beautiful pass to McCaw and a foul. What a gorgeous look that was by Bell. Uh oh, let's oh. hope McCaw's all right. Oh, he hit his. Oh, boy. Hit that. Uh... Just this, this Warriors team is snake bit right now. And you can see the reaction from Steve Kerr. Right on the right ankle. Oh, Ooh, gosh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Pal, number 13. Brown, smart on one side by Wiggins to the rack. Right. Oh, no. oh. He's concussed. And the athletic trainers out there quickly. And let's just hope that is it because that fall, it looked like it could have been his neck. The final bucket. Okogi coast to coast. And, and they're going to get a. Well, they're looking for help today. Signal block charge as Russell gets up. And still down on New Jersey. Doesn't look good. Yep, it does not. Oh. will undergo surgery Monday to repair a right medial meniscus expected to be out six to eight weeks. The eight knee with 649 left in the Spurs win over the Pistons on. And Dunn's got a freebie. And you've got a five-point game. Dunn. Chicago will use a timeout as Chris Dunn is hurt. Cut his lip or oh, he cut his lower lip. You can see that. The game. Dunn goes down with... Clay didn't see him. He got taken from the side, but no one. Dunn did this oh, all himself. No. Oh my goodness. Oh no. Oh man. Ow. To protect himself. And if you wonder why you don't put your arms out, try to break your fall, it's still precarious. 252 left. And Dunn is up. Okafor is on the run. Okafor, he went down and uh, oh, twisted his ankle. Oh, man. He tried to. Put him in the traffic, and uh, I don't know if he stepped on some. No, nope. no, just no, he foot just, that call. Yeah, he was trying to. Appears to be as they help him up. Right on the forehead, above the eye. See the old man. Right there. Obviously, when you hot, that blood squirts. So you watch the inadvertent elbow catching him on the head. So he's going to go back to the locker room and have a. Eight points for the night. And, oh. oh man, oh man, that is not good. That is not good, folks. Kevin Love. Oh, indeed it did. Both the tailbone and the head, Jim. That's a double whammy. Oh, that is just painful. There's a, there's a lot to handle out there too, but in a different way. Also, Norman Powell just checked in.
down low. O'Neal with the bucket, and Royce with an eight-point half. Call by Toronto. I don't know if that shoulder popped or if they just went shoulder to shoulder. He hadn't been on the floor, T, for more than two or three seconds, and the contact was made, and he's off to the locker room. He put a hand down trying to take the ball away from Rudy, and the, and the left arm just got extended. Shoulder, but he went right to the locker room and knew something wasn't right. Yeah, it didn't. To Steven Adams. He has been all of that this year. Went up to block the shot of Wiggins. Met him at the rim. And Noel, who already took a big time bump from Towns early on. And he is on the floor as the Thunder staff goes out immediately. And you see that as the head got cocked back thanks to the forum, and then he hit his head on the deck. As they're going to put him on the stretcher. Mark Stoudemire never saw it coming. He was trying to get out of the way, and I just think that you see it, his arm just gets right up oh, underneath his man. bottom side, and can't tell if Stats' right arm pushed him in the back or if he just tried to, you know, get out of the way.